What's up everyone? It's the Tyrant here. Welcome back to my Lazo challenge for Halo 2 anniversary. Uh, so today we're doing the mission Metropolis and this one worries me a little bit. The mission is actually pretty easy on regular legendary uh, compared to some of the other missions in this game, but with all the skulls active, uh, this also means that I can't drive unless I hijack one of the Covenant vehicles, which is needless to say pretty challenging. So that's what we're going to try to do today. I'm going to see how many times it's going to take or just I'm going to see how far I can get. So this is, again, sort of my compromise to you guys. Instead of doing a walkthrough, I'm actually just showing you sort of the the uh, growing pains that I go through when I actually put mythic walkthroughs together. So that's what we're going to try to do today. Uh, this is the third mission of the game, even though it's his mission five. I don't know why. I guess because the cutscenes technically count as missions, which is weird. So as you can see, I can't actually get into the Warthog, which is usually my choice instead of the tank, so I can rush across the bridge as fast as possible. I'm checking right here just to make sure I've got my battle rifle because I can't see my weapons. I don't know what the starting weapons for this mission are, but I'm guessing that it's going to be the battle rifle and the SMG. So it looks like we have to truck it across the bridge on foot, which means I've got to deal with an army of ghosts as well as a wraith. And eventually some phantoms too. So one of the things I do enjoy about the Scarab Skull is I can watch these ghosts just fly and apparently some of the damaged cars as well. It's pretty cool to see just how much detail they put into this environment and how much uh, destructible environment is actually here. So I'm going to see if I can get the Wraith early on. Uh, I definitely got its attention. I don't know how many shots it takes with the Scarab Gun to actually destroy a Wraith, especially with the Mythic Skull active. But we're going to try it anyway. It's not moving, so I'm guessing I got it. I see some flames coming up from it. There we go. Okay, so we got more ghosts on the way. Let's see if I can take those guys out. Again, I don't know if the best method here would be to uh, try to hijack one of the ghosts or just to try to destroy everything. What I'm worried about in terms of just trying to nuke everything on the bridge, I'm going to try to stealth, and it's still shooting at me. And okay, first attempt. So apparently even when I'm invisible, they can see me, but when they're invisible, I can't see them. Uh, that makes me think of Caboose from Red versus Blue. They can't see me because I can't see them. You're facing the wrong direction, Caboose. All right, so I'm going to try to see if I can hijack one of these ghosts, see if I can rush across the bridge, just like I would in the Warthog. Um... So let me see if I can try to stealth and see if that'll work. Okay, where are they? Oh, there he is. Come on. Going after my Marines, I see. Oh, oh. All right, let's try this again. I'm going to see if I can lure it over here. Come on, buddy. Come on. No? Oh, there you are. There you are. All right, invisible. All right, so I got the ghost. All right, that now we're on a... Ah! That did not last long. I was on that ghost for literally about a second before the other two took me out. Where did that other ghost come from anyway? I thought there was only two. All right, so there's absolutely no way I can get in the tank. Wow. I wonder how much better I would do if that skull was not on. Of course, that's not the name of the game here. We got to play with all skulls on, so I can't do that. But it would be interesting to see if I could just get into the Warthog and rush across the bridge, how easy the rest of this mission would actually be. All right, so I'm going to see if I can hijack the ghost again. Oh, don't back away. Don't back away. Come on. There we go. All these elites are ultras. Okay, that did not last long again. So I don't know what the shield recharge rate is here, uh, but it looks like... Because I don't know if it's like the regular skull where you have to melee enemies. <laughs> Look at that thing fly. Um, where you have to melee all these enemies to get your shields back, just like in standard uh, Lazo or Mythic in Halo 3 onward. But I think your shields actually do end up recharging by themselves. Or, of course, maybe I can just hit regular objects, just like in regular Halo 2, where you can hit even, like, trash cans and stuff to get your shields back. You do have overshields with this skull on, so that's a definite plus. 
Okay, so we ran away. My guys are up there. You know, I, as long as my Marines don't rocket me as I'm in the Ghost, I feel like that's not too bad. Okay, so let's see if I can... Come on, come on. Come back to me. Come back, come back. Okay, so we got the Ghost again. Let's see how far I can actually get this time. So far, so good. Okay, my shields are down, though. Come on, come on. We're almost there. Oh! Almost got to the top of the bridge. It doesn't look like I'm going to be... It looks like that ghost was about to get nuked. Uh, if only it stayed on screen just a little bit longer. So it looks like trying to get a ghost is not going to be the best methodology here. Check this out. I can't even get in the gunner seat and let the Marines drive me. I have to... So UNSC vehicles are going to be completely off limits in this game until we reach the flood missions later. So it looks like I'm just going to have to go at it on foot not exactly the the best way to go about this mission it's not what it was designed for again i kind of wonder how much better i would be doing if that skull was not active so i could actually drive across the bridge but that's okay all right so again i'm going to see if i can take out the wraith that's one less thing i have to worry about i think the wraith is still active okay that should have gotten it i do see it burning All right, so we're going to take this nice and slow. Now, again, what worries me about doing it this way is what happens when I run out of ammunition because there's no other ammo on the bridge that I remember. So, and I think there's like infinite ghosts that spawn up until you reach a certain point. They just keep coming at you. Whoa, check that out. I can make a game out of that alone. See how far I can fling the fling the ghost with a combination of the scarab gun and the Sputnik skull. Whoa! That is up and out of here. <laughs> that ghost got destroyed midair, hit the barrier, I guess. That was funny. Alright, so again, let's see what we can do here. More ghosts coming. I have to make sure that when these ghosts land, they don't land like somewhere behind me. Because keep in mind with the Mythic Skull on, their health is a lot, lot more buffed up. So with that in mind, they may not get destroyed even with the Scarab Gun. They might just be flung way across the bridge and then come back to get me later. So I'm just trying to take this nice and slow here. We're, we're about as far as I was on the ghost. So this method might actually work a little bit better as long as my ammo stays intact. Whoop, I was paying so much attention to that other ghost that I forgot about these two that were coming. And we are just destroying this bridge worse than the Covenant. Okay, did I see the Wraith move? I feel like I saw the Wraith move. Okay, is that guy still around? Nope, okay. I think... Oh, more ghosts. Okay, so that ghost is taken care of. We're almost at the top of the bridge, so... Now I'm not so sure about that wraith. It's not... Oh! Okay, it's still around. So I gotta go after him now, too. Alright, come on. I know my aim is terrible, but... Got to get that Wraith. Whoa! Nope, nope. Okay. Almost, almost sputnicked me off the bridge there. Whoa, no, 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 no. No, no, no. There we go. Okay. Now, let's see. Did I get the Wraith? It looks like it's on fire. But it's still facing me. Nope, I definitely did not get the Wraith. Ah, yeah, that Sputnik skull. This thing is strong. Taking direct hits from a scarab gun. It's still facing me. Come on. It's not using its... Oh! Flung right off the bridge. Swimming... Oh, there's the elite right there. <laughs> from one of the other ghosts. Alright, so I'm going to call it a day there. This mission, I don't know how doable it's going to be with the skull on that doesn't allow me to drive vehicles unless I jack, uh, hijack them first. But we're going to try again. 
uh, probably next week or the week after with the mission the Arbiter maybe that one will be a little bit easier we'll find out but I'd love to hear your thoughts on this mission in the comment section below and I want to take a moment to thank you all for taking the time out of your busy day to sit down and watch this video I do hope that you enjoyed it and if you did I hope you'll consider subscribing for more great content right here on mythictower.com thank you all so much for watching I hope everyone here has a wonderful week I'll catch you all right back here next time and as always I'm the tyrant signing off